Okay, Husker fans, so much has happened in the world of Nebraska volleyball. Let's dive into it all. All 14 of Nebraska's players could have returned from that 2023 season, but only 10 of them did. Let's talk about the four that moved on from the program. Sophomore Hayden Kubik will head to Tennessee. The outside hitter appeared in 13 matches across two seasons with the Cornhuskers. She'll look for more playing time in the SEC. Sophomore middle Maggie Mendelson moves on from the program and goes over to Penn State where she will just focus on volleyball rather than being a dual sport athlete like she was in Lincoln. Maggie Mendelson started five matches for the Cornhuskers this season. And with Maggie Mendelson leaving, that only left two middle blockers on the roster and Andy Jackson and also Becca Alex. So this man, John Cook, needed to go into the transfer portal and find another middle. We'll address that later on. And then there's Caroline Jarevicius, who'll be playing at Penn State alongside Maggie Mendelson. Jarevicius took a red shirt her freshman season as a Cornhusker, and she was the only freshman out of that group to not see the court during her first year at Lincoln. And with Jarevicius leaving, that leaves Merritt Beeson as the only opposite hitter on the roster. Then the fourth player to transfer out of Lincoln would be Allie Batenhorst, the junior outside hitter. She has yet to announce where she's going to continue her career, but her plan right now is to graduate from Lincoln in May and then use her graduate transfer years to keep playing volleyball. A week before Allie Batenhorst entered the transfer portal, that's when John Cook and company picked up the transfer out of Minnesota, Taylor Landfair, one of the top out of the transfer portal, and reportedly she chose Nebraska over Wisconsin. Taylor Landfair is an athletic pin hitter. She was a 2022 Big Ten Player of the Year. Didn't have quite the amount of numbers as she usually has this past season, but it doesn't matter. She is as athletic as ever and will be a huge addition to the Nebraska offense. And of course, there's a lot of speculation that Allie Batenhorst left because of Taylor Lanfair's addition to the team. But in her TikTok, Allie Batenhorst did talk about how she's been thinking about this a while and it was not an impulse decision. So for the 2024 season, that leaves John Cook with four outside hitters in Lindsey Krause, who will be a senior, Skylar Pierce, an incoming freshman, and then Harper Murray, a now sophomore, and of course, the junior Taylor Lanfair, who has two years of eligibility left. John Cook still needed to address the depth at middle blocker and there was a freed up scholarship with Batenhorst leaving. So he went into the portal and got Layla Blackwell, a middle blocker out of San Diego. Blackwell has just one year left of eligibility. She actually started her college career at Indiana, so she's familiar with Big Ten volleyball, and then moved over to San Diego, where in her three years there, she was all-conference first team every single season. Husker fans, I hope that cleared up your questions on the 2024 roster. Let us know in the comments who you're most excited to see out on the court next season.